2K Sports for Wednesday night action in the NBA. Kevin Harlan here with Greg Anthony and a pair of Hall of Famers with us, Doris Burke and David Aldridge. It's the Chicago Bulls taking on the Washington Wizards. And it's going to be the Bulls off the tip. And here's Rose. Let's check out Chicago's starting lineup. Boozer is out there with Taj Gibson. Then there's Derek Rose. Then there's Kyle Corp. And it's Noah in its center. Here's Westbrook. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Bonga, no good. And so it's Rose bringing it up for Chicago. Gibson finds Rose. Good on the three-point shot. Well, Derek Rose just so confident, so dangerous in catch-and-shoot situations. Boy, has he become a terrific shooter. And the foul on Derek Rose. That is his first foul of the game. Bulls on D. It's a three-point game. against Robinson down to five on the shot clock a shot off that time great defense that time from Noah boy that's 0 for 3 in the early going just a little out of sync Rose good boy what a warrior Derek Rose is guy gets buckets through contact out there so tough guys they're looking for a way to score here yeah they've had a tough time taking the lid off and that one is good from Bradley Beal. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. And I think defensively, that is not the way you want to start. Giving up high percentage looks, that doesn't typically end well. First trip to the line for him here. What I love about Joe Kim Noah is how fierce a competitor he has been throughout the course of his career. And he's an outstanding passer as well. Here's Washington now. Outside Westbrook. Over Rose. Westbrook with the bucket. The defense making it way too easy for him on that jump shot. He'll take that all night. Rose against Westbrook. The feed now to Corver. Boozer inside. Corver finds Rose. Back to Corver. The three. It's good. This time the assist from Rose. No one's ever questioned his court vision. Rose playing unselfish basketball, being the leader this team needs him to be. Westbrook up top. He's covered by Rose. The 19-foot shot. Here's Lopez. Count that bucket. Boy, the work ethic on the offensive glass just refuses to give up on that possession. Here's Rose. And the layup's good off the glass. Rose has got seven. They've wasted no time settling into their offense. Outside Westbrook. From the strike. That one's not going to go. And Chicago will go the other way with the ball. Not a lot falling for him in this quarter. He's got to stay aggressive, try to break through, see if you can get an easy opportunity. So timeout called here, the first for Washington. And with their offense sputtering, coaches. We're about three minutes into this first quarter. Here's Neto. He's covered by Brown. There's Beal with the three. It's hauled in by the Bulls. Here's Miller. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Hadley Beal picks one up. Chicago shooting their third and fourth free throw shot to the night. That free throw good from Miller. Wizards making a switch here. Second free throw, no good. Talk about receding in the playoffs when you got down to the final four teams. If it ensures the two best teams make the finals, it would seem to me, Greg, to be worth it. What about you? You know, it could be. I think about the, the worldwide attention on that championship round, but you got to get the Eastern Conference teams to sign off on that. And, you know, we've seen it happen in the past where the, the power shifts from one conference to the other. But ultimately, nothing better than seeing the two best teams play for it all. 
Here's Winston. Matthews finds Len. Passes to Winston. Clock at four. And another miss by Washington. Chicago leading by nine. Miller outside. Inside. One on one here. Good D by Miller. Boy, this guy is a good finisher, so he misses a chippy. That's tough to take. Jones kicks to Miller. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Williams passes to Brown. Let's it go with a three. One up, one down. Two points with his first shot this game. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. Stolen away. Oh, and here comes Miller all alone. Seventeen seconds left to play in the first. Here's Neto. He's covered by Brown. Here's Neto. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And so it's Chicago, sitting with a comfortable lead up by 14. Their defense has been active and of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. And the Bulls guys have been rolling right along, haven't they? Guys, I love their defense in that first period. They were in position and just challenging shots. Well, I think they combined great intelligence with great effort, and you can see the results. So for Chicago right now, we've got Brian Scalabrini on out there with Jones, and it's Miller, and it's Williams at the center, filling out the middle. And the Wizards with possession after the Bulls pick up two. It's stolen by Brown. And now here comes Williams leading the break. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touch by Williams. That almost looked like bad communication. You hate to see that kind of mistake. Wizards trail by 14. Williams comes with a double team. Here's Neto. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. And good that time. Yeah, that's nice work in there on the inside. Lopez not having any issues converting that time. Round the pass to Williams. Just over one minute has passed here in the second quarter. Now the pass to Miller. Here is Scalabrini. Shot from 12. He hits the back iron and sinks the shot. Scalabrini's got the lead up to 14 now for the Bulls. Here's Neto. To the middle. Hangs in the air. And he makes that one. land has got his first bucket in this one. What I'm already seeing out of Alex Len, more aggression than when he first entered the lead. Here's Scalabrini. That shot, no good. Good D by Lopez. Scalabrini's gone one of three from the field here. Matthews scanning the floor. Pass to Neto. Now here's Lopez. And he gets the bucket. Lopez has got six points. You know, good example of strength and control there by Lopez. He took some contact on that one. And it's Williams with the jam. Not the kind of aggressive defense they need to cut into the lead. Bills checked in for Matthews. And Russell Westbrook is subbed in for Raul Neto. Chicago also making some changes. Jones checked in for Miller. Jones comes in for Jones. And it's Rose in for Brown. Now here's Westbrook. Chicago grabs the miss. Williams has got four rebounds now tonight. Boy, a miss like that will drive any score crazy, especially with the defender giving a cushion. Puts up a three, and that comes off the assist by Jones. He's got nine. Such a boost to this offense when this guy can knock down uncontested threes. Here's Westbrook. And it's Scalabrini with the rebound. I'll tell you, no matter what he does, he can't find his rhythm, and you get the sense he's starting to press a little bit. Getting it done on both ends, and it shows up in the score. 
Well, what I love is the energy they're bringing right now. They're ignoring the scoreboard and playing hard. Here's Beal. The Bulls getting the bucket over Scalabrini. The wide open look here for Lopez. The Wizards with another miss. And with the success they've had rebounding the basketball, they're right where you'd expect them to be firmly in the driver's seat. I tell you, this guy still plays with a star's mentality. The strong drive converts against physical, physical defense. Here's Westbrook following the score by Derrick Rose. Outside Westbrook. Lopez kicks to Robinson. Five to shoot. To halt the run. The Wizards with another miss. And so it's Rose bringing it up for the Chicago Bulls. Jones, no luck. And here's the break. Here's Beal. The 17-footer goes down. Beal's got his second bucket of the night. That jumper translates to every spot on the floor. Bradley Beal becomes harder and harder to guard. Rose dishes to Williams. And the rebound goes to Lopez. Lopez has got five rebounds tonight. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need a basket. Westbrook with a wide-open look. Sinks it from just inside the baseline. Well, you love seeing Westbrook fire with confidence from the mid-range. This guy knows he can consistently make those shots. How many times have we seen a possession take that from them today? Ending with a basket, coming off a pretty pass. Here's Robinson following the score by Derrick Rose. Robinson passes to Len. Back to Robinson. And the call will be against Robin Lopez. That is his first foul of the game. Brown feeling it out a bit. Here's Boozer. And so it's Chicago. Feeling good about their 17-point lead heading into the break. Their defense has been very... It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back to 2K Sports. Derrick Rose taking care of business in this one. He ended up with 15 points and one block. He was on the fringes in their last game. Tonight, he's been the centerpiece. And Kenny, what did you And that'll do it for us. The third quarter about to begin with Kevin Harlan standing by. We'll catch you on the flip side, my brother. If the next two quarters are any different from the first two, so far it has been a runaway. A fantastic game from Derrick Rose in this one. He had a fast pass to the lane that first half. Got inside on demand. Now this guy is such a good finisher on the move, and so far the defense has not been able to counter it. Russell Westbrook out there with Robinson. And there's Robin Lopez. And there's Bradley Beal. And it's Bonga in at the power forward. That's the group on the floor right now for Washington. Well, this is a nice pass, and when healthy, Rose still one of the best floor generals out there. Beal, that's for two. Rebound by Carlos Boozer. They have been board dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor in crafting this huge lead. No coverage that time. Corver's got six points. Come on, how pretty is the shooting stroke of Kyle Corver? That three-point shot just so pure. Beal, that's for two. That doesn't go either for Beal. The Bulls leading by 20. Outside Gibson. Down low. And here's the fast break. Beal leading the way. And finished off by Beal. And that matters not. Half court or in transition, Bradley Beal always a threat. Boozer kicks to Rose. Over a minute and a half into the third quarter of action. And credit the screen for giving him the space he needed to get to the rim. For sure, GA allows him to come in with the... He's checked in for the Wizards. Raul Neto comes in for Russell Westbrook. So for the Bulls. 
Here's Neto. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. And the way they have controlled the glass this game, really impressive. And bottom line, more boards means more possessions. That's how you build a lead. You know, miss that one, but still a really good start coming off the break. Three for four now. Pass to Bonga. Lopez kicks to Beal. Three-pointer. That shot off the mark. So the Bulls will take it the other way. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Round the pass to Jones. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Brown dishes to Jones. A shot's good. Brown making the play. Brown's got three assists tonight. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly and capitalizing. Chicago leading by 22. He lobs up the alley-oop pass. Oh, what a pass. And then he lays it in with the circus move. Mm, so smooth. Yeah, 153 left to play in the third. Beal gets a wide open look. Sinks the triple. Beal's got 11. Wow, he looks like a completely different player in this half. He's found his rhythm. Round the pass to Smith. Miller outside. Back to Smith. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Adley Beal picks one up. You know, I love how he absorbs the foul and still had a chance to knock that one down. And the Wizards making a change here. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. Here's Beal. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. And you know, he's enjoyed the kind of day you expect in terms of shooting the basketball. He can bring them right back into this game. You know, the amazing thing to me is as much as Bradley Beal has turned into a complete player for a guy who entered as simply a jump shooter, I think there's even another level he can get to. Scalabrini kicks to Smith. Len grabs the board. The Wizards trail by 20. To the paint. Shoots from the line. It's all in by the Bulls. The biggest lead of the game was 24 points. It's Brown on the wing. Outside, Jones. The shot's good. Brown making the play. Brown's got his fourth assist in this one. And, and no matter who it is, that kind of D isn't going to get it done. Passes it to Len. Here's Winston. Knocked away. It's stolen by Smith. And now running up the court. Miller pushing it up. Let's it go from deep. Bunga pulls it in. There's Beal with the three. Washington gets it back. That one falls. Well, just terrific instincts right there from Alex Len on the offensive glass. Really impressive. Miller outside. Got it off in time. And that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. And so it's the Chicago Bulls sitting on a 21-point lead to end the quarter. The scoring is... And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same from the first three quarters. Okay, now let's reset our lineups courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go for this fourth quarter. So the Bulls five right now. Taj Gibson is out there with Carlos Boozer. Then there's Kyle Corp. Then it's Rose. And it's Noah in at the five, roaming the paint. Let's it go from 14. Listen, we know the mid-range game is in this guy's arsenal, but you wonder should he have moved it just one pass more. Not watching the line there. That'll be a backcourt violation. Westbrook dishes the land. The pass to Robinson. 
Land against Noah. Len passes to Bonga over Boozer. Bonga, no good. And so it's Rose bringing it up for the Chicago Bulls. At the elbow, it's Noah. It's good. This time, the assist from Rose. Noah's got the fourth quarter going with the first basket of the period here for the Bulls. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Back to Len. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. This is called getting a better understanding of the game. How and when to attack. Len going to the free throw line. Two shots. Both free throws good from Len. A few possessions into the fourth quarter. Just over a minute played. Rose looking around. Kicks to Noah. From deep three-point range, his second miss of the game still has him shooting eight for ten. Wizards trail by 21. Outside Westbrook. Pass to Robinson. Back to Westbrook. From the arc. Hands it from downtown. I love how Westbrook rises and fires immediately. Ball touches his hands and it's gone before you can blink. And the basket by Rose. Rose has got 19 points. No doubt about the consistency when it comes to scoring the basketball for him tonight. A real nice lift for their offense. And we're about two minutes into the fourth time quarter now. Out. Washington calls timeout. Well, Final it's been has checked in for Len. <laughs> Westbrook passes to Lopez. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Boozer's got four rebounds now tonight. Pass to Noah. He dishes it to Boozer. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. Well, that's not the guy you want guarding him at the rim. Just too much of a differential in terms of size. Westbrook with it. To the right side. Robinson for three. Cranes the three-pointer. Robinson's got his first three points of the game. Yeah, that's back-to-back -back threes. The D just seems to be slacking off a little bit. And he gets it to go as they call the foul. He's on his way to the line for one more. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. And if they continue, Kevin, their outstanding free throw shooting, that'll help them seal the deal. Outside, Beal. They get the rebound. I didn't see that miss coming. I mean, he's usually been money from that range. Here's Rose. Can't hit the free throw line jump. So it's Washington now. 16 feet away, and he hits the jump shot. How about the balance? Beal stopping on a dime. Westbrook against Rose. Over Westbrook. Off the left rim and out. And it didn't fall, but that's the kind of shot they want their offense to create. You know, it can be frustrating when you make the right play and fail to reap the rewards. You just have to stay with it here. Yeah, the D has not been able to keep the ball out of the paint at that end of the floor. Wizards making a switch here. Well, what you love about Russell Westbrook, yes, he can give you a triple-double every night. But what I love more is the passion and the fact that he gives it to you every single night he plays. Here's Beal. It's good. That's eight baskets for him now. Eight for 15 shooting. Coming off a big game, his confidence couldn't be higher, and Coach knows it. Well, the best players to me deliver night after night after night. So as long as he's hot, keep riding it. And the Wizards with possession. They trail by 18. Winston the pass to Bell. It's Beal on the wing. And again, Washington with the triple. If you let Bradley Beal get cooking, you can turn the lights out. This guy is rolling right now. And that one's good by Noah. Relentless in their approach, even with the game firmly in hand. This is a textbook example of playing the possession and not the score. This team is doing a great job continuing to execute. And it's Westbrook. That time on the assist by Bell. Westbrook's got eight points in the quarter. 
boy, it will take more than that kind of defense to stop this guy. Russell Westbrook so fierce on the interior. Outside Rose. Count that one. And the Bulls lead by 17. And once they smelled blood in the water, you could see the killer instinct take over. And you want to save your best for last. Tonight, they've done that and then some. Gibson with the steal. Rose against Westbrook. Goes up at the stripe. Rose can't hit. And here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for Washington. Two seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Takes the three. And again, Washington with the triple. Well, just incredible instincts from Russell Westbrook. How about that pass? On time, on target. Make it easy. Rose. Oh, and the jam by Rose. And, and those are the kinds of plays that are just killing them right now. Westbrook against Corver. Now here's Westbrook. And so Chicago takes this one, and by a big margin. This crowd was stunned by the manner in which their team was dismantled. You know what? Shocking. I don't care what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to come in and just cruise to the kind of win they did tonight. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Doris Burke, David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.